Welcome back to War of Rights, where I played potentially my shortest game ever, and that is as good as the battle got for us. It started well enough, we took a blocking position up in these bushes, we suffered two or three casualties, and then for some reason decided to fall back. Well, that's the order given, so we're going to run through the open under continuous fire. I'm sure there's some excellent cover awaiting us in the middle of that open field. Here comes their volley, it's down to the fake gods now. Hey, I've made it, and there's the other regiment, hiding behind two very small rocks. I'm not convinced we're all going to fit behind it. Oh! Oh, he was executed. And as usual, I'm going to back away from the flag very slowly. This is the point when their RT zeroes us, and doesn't let up for the rest of the game. It was laser accurate. Well, that's most of the regiment, and the flag's down again. Of course, I'm going to back away. Thanks for picking it up. With so many of us turned into human chum, they're of course going to charge and push us off the point. Here they come out of the smoke. Well, time to do my part and take one of them out. This is going to be a great shot. Oh, that's a bad time to spawn. Ah, that one. It's a complete miss. It's time to run away. We've made it back to our second fallback position. It's another tiny rock. They're still following us. Oh, I actually got one. Unbelievable. Obviously about 70 players hiding behind one tiny rock isn't going to cut it, so we're going to fall back again. But who's that in the distance? I only think that's the guy who executed our flag bearer earlier. He's only got a revolver, let's take him out. Of course, revolvers have more than one shot. I'm back, and this position looks worse than the last one. This is really exposed. I'm going to hang at the back and use people's bodies to soak up the incoming fire. So far, so good. Finally, we've got orders to move, and having both flags in the same place makes an enormous target. Yep, there they both go. Well, I'll keep heading towards that small bush. Hmm, that incoming fire tells me they might be onto our plan. Ah, more of us at the bush. Oh yep, here comes the fire. Ah, flag's down again. Best avoid that. Oh no, I think the flag bearer stood next to me. Now I'm a target. Huh. And now I'm covered in the flag bearer. Just gonna back away. Their artillery is doing a fantastic job at tearing us to pieces. I've been pretty lucky thus far. Oh. Here's a spawn that's going to psychologically scar me. Ugh. Their artillery is so coordinated, I think they've trained two cannons on us at once. Yep, there goes everybody. But look at these three legends still holding the position. And when I say position, I mean one small rock and a field of bodies. Obviously we don't want to join these corpses and drop morale by dying out of line, so we're going to make a big suicidal run across the field and get back to our flag bearer. Oh, stand by, we've got a reinforcement. Or one of them. Okay, let's do this. No, 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 forget it. Turn around, run away, back to the rock. That way is terrible. Okay, I guess we'll just sit here and wait for a better idea to come along. And here comes the rest of the team, and they brought some flags to help mark our positions for the artillery. That officer should really crouch, he's very obvious in his lovely coat. Oh, there he goes, and that's another cannonball survived. Oh, and the second one! It's time to get out of here. We're retreating again, and somebody's looking for the captain. I think he's all over there. We're pretty far back when this guy takes a shot from somewhere. Oh, yep, it appears we have been completely flanked. Well, I suppose that's slightly better than being blown to pieces by cannonballs. Oh look, a cannonball. Ah. Well, with about a minute to go, there's time for one last desperate charge. Oh look, we got our flag back. And you are getting so stabbed. At least by sprinting around the map and poking people, there's less chance of us being torn apart by artillery. Now we just need to clear out of that bush over there and probably still lose anyway. But at least go down with some dignity. Oh, he's a goner. 
Oh, I hate people with revolvers. Ah, he's gone. Oh. And just to highlight how good their artillery was, we lost twice as many men. Thank you for watching, and like and subscribe for more War of Rights.